Saturday. Hey guys, before we jump into this one, I just want to apologize if I sound a bit sniffly and congested. I am still getting over this flu. I'm struggling with a sore throat, but we're getting through it. I'm still going to get my review out to you and I appreciate your support. So please do sit back and enjoy. G'day guys and welcome back to Ados the Great YouTube channel. So guys, in today's video, I'll be giving you my rapid review of Game 3, The Decider. Obviously, being a Queensland supporter, I'm very disappointed about the result. But at the end of the day, it is what it is. And New South Wales, they wanted it more. They got the job done. And I'll tell you what, man, the fans wanted it more. It hurts me to say that. It hurts me to admit. But you're just watching on TV and seeing, like, the Sea of Maroon at Suncorp Stadium. And then hearing the small, I would say 70% of the fans at Suncorp Stadium were Maroon, 30% New South Wales. But the Blues fans, in my opinion, were louder than the Maroons. I heard the Blues chants more often than I did the Maroons. That was disappointing to me. And I genuinely believe that that is a massive reason the Blues got over the line. Uh, in terms of the game, look, I'm pretty impressed with how Queensland played. The Blues threw everything at the Maroons early on in that game. Uh, it was, you know, the, the Blues were physical. They, they, would, you know, they were trying to break through Queensland's wall of defence. But... In, the, in saying that, like the Maroons' wall was really good for 65 minutes, that the Blues couldn't break it. It was it was impressive, and personally, I thought that first half of footy was some of the best Origin I have ever seen, if not the best I have ever seen. I do think Ashley Klein did ruin the game a bit. Thought there was definitely calls both ways that should have been picked up on, and then there was definitely calls both ways that did get picked up on that probably shouldn't have and they should have just let the game flow a bit more. Uh, I thought the sin bids were absolutely ridiculous. I don't think either player deserved to get sin bid. Let the boys play. It's state of origin. Move on. Let the game flow. Uh, look, it's pretty obvious New South Wales won the uh, the field possession, time in possession as well. Uh, Queensland had about 107, I think, more tackles than the Blues, both sides Tackle efficiency was actually pretty similar. I think Queensland was 86%, New South Wales was 85%. Uh, and the completion rate, Queensland were 82 New South Wales were 80 So very similar there. It was just, you know, the metres gained. I think the Blues had about 300 metres more than the Maroons. Uh, the Blues, I think, doubled Queensland in line breaks. They had at least eight more tackle breaks. Uh, I think they had... A, eight more offloads as well, or 10 more offloads. I think it was, think it was 18 8 for the Maroons. Like, realistically, the Blues dominated this game, as they did the majority of the series, to be honest, as well. So the, the Blues deserve this, absolutely. I'm not going to take anything away from them. But I do think Queensland really stood up in this game defensively and played well for 65 minutes. And then they just fell asleep, they got lazy, they were tired, and New South Wales made them pay. I thought Connor Watson came on at the perfect time. He ran rings and started this. Jerome Lloyd was incredible as well. I thought he was one of the Blues' best. Um, Dylan Edwards, rightly so, got the end of the match, ran for like 250 metres, uh, had about seven tackle breaks, like he was incredible. Uh, Paddy Carrigan, 61 tackles for the Maroons. He was just working his butt off, as was Ruben Cotter. I think he had 53 tackles. Paddy Carrigan only missed two as well. Uh, I thought Dane Gagai, while there was that poor attempt at a tackle on uh, teammate Bradman Best that led to the best try, I thought Gagai was actually really good in defence outside of that. Like He missed six tackles, but he made 26, which was far more than any other centre, and he also made more than some of the Queensland forwards, so that is saying something like he worked his butt off in this game. Uh, look, disappointing result, obviously I'm not happy about it, but we move on, New South Wales get the job done, and congratulations Blues, enjoy it, you deserve it, but we're coming back for that trophy next year. Thank you guys so much for tuning in, I appreciate your support, and as always my friends, I will see you in the next one. Thanks, guys.